Star Wars fans, real quick video. I was at a place in Kansas City uh, last week, and it's called Vintage Stock. They have a whole bunch of stores all throughout the Midwest, and they carry a whole bunch of retro video games. They carry a whole bunch of retro to toys. I wanted to show you kind of what I picked up. I got each of these figures for $10 each, uh, amazingly enough. So uh, I thought I got a pretty good deal. Now, all these appear that they have been opened, and they've been kind of repacked. Uh, but for $10 each, I felt it was a fantastic deal. So let me show you what I got. We're going to start with the Empire Strikes Back here. This is a Star Destroyer Commander. And as you can see, it's been opened because it's been cut off here. But, uh, you know, card itself is in pretty decent shape. Uh, figure comes with the gun, so it's complete. And the figure itself is in, in great shape. So I thought, you know, you can see it's been taped up again. But for $10, even for a loose figure, like in this condition, I thought it was a really good deal. And plus, you get the card back as well. Uh, really cool looking. You get the Kenner. On the back, you get the other accessories that were out at the time, and the other figures is a 41 back uh, card back. This is Darth Vader, and Press Race back. And this is really cool, I got this for $10. And what I thought was cool about this is it comes, comes complete with a cape, vinyl cape, which is pretty hard to find when it's loose. It comes with a lightsaber as well, uh, and the card is in, in great shape overall. And this is also 41 back. And the back is a little bit different than the one over here, which I showed you. See how the accessories are a bit different? These came out in 1980, these figures. But yeah, the bubble also is non-yellowed. Uh, pretty good shape bubble. There's a little crease right here up overall for being uh, 30 years old, 31 years old. Not, not bad shape bubble. Now this is where it gets interesting. This is uh, vintage Obi-Wan Kenobi, also with vinyl cape and lightsaber. And on the back, it's a 21 back. The bubble itself is in great shape. That's Obi Wan Kenobi. I love the back. Uh, you know, up until this point, I've only had um, C3PO on card back, so it was really cool to see these. As you saw before in previous videos, I've had, I do have cards, uh, but they're all loose. Okay, I don't have the bubbles and stuff to go with it. This is Princess Leia. Now this has been open. She's missing uh, the cape with her and uh, all that good stuff. But here's here's where it gets cool. This is a 12 back, which you don't see many of these. And these are the first run. This is original 12 figures. Uh, and it shows you the figures itself. Okay, I do have a loose card back. And I have the C3PO, which is a 12 back as well, which is in mint condition that I showed you. But that's pretty cool. Again, the bubble is, is pretty much flawless. Okay, these came out in 1977. Last one I'm going to show you is Sand People, Tuscan Raiders. This is before they called it Tuscan Raider. Uh, it's the same people against the vinyl bubbles in perfect shape. Uh, it comes with a staff. And this is a 12 back as well, which is really cool. So I got picked up two 12 back. And this, unfortunately, is cut open right here. It's kind of a bummer. So I felt, felt overall, uh, for the price for $10, I felt it was a pretty good deal on, on all these uh, $10 each. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. And may the force be with you. Take care. Bye bye.